So M is a TikToker with Tourette syndrome, and M has no problem talking about their Tourettes, showing their tics on camera. <laughs> Until one day, people online start accusing M of faking their Tourettes. And what proof do these anonymous people have? Well, M also has a pagan yarn dyeing business. That's a real thing which M produces separate content for on YouTube. And in the videos for this account, you may notice M doesn't have any ticks, which is wildly different from the way M acts on TikTok. So people notice this and they are not happy and they start blowing up M's comment section. You don't really have Tourette's. You're faking it. What the hell is pagan yarn? So M sees this and M makes kind of a playful video reply, sort of addressing it, but not really taking the hate seriously. But then before all this chaos, someone created a subreddit dedicated to nothing but investing investigating M. And people are posting all kinds of stuff there. Like an old video of M on a live stream performing a spoken word poem, but no ticks. Or the contents of your mind. So M continues to get dragged through the mud. And I guess that does it. Cause finally M starts taking this seriously. And they make a TikTok showing proof that they have Tourette's. Showing an outpatient consultation document. But people in that subreddit are still not convinced. And they immediately start debunking it. Now on that medical document she showed, it does in fact say Tourette's. However, However, it also says Huntington's disease, which to be fair, Huntington's disease can sometimes cause certain kinds of tics. But then in a weird twist, someone in the subreddit finds an old video of M talking about having Huntington's. May is Huntington's Disease Awareness Month, so I decided to make this video. And the video's five minutes long and in it, M has no tics. So people don't know what to believe at this point, including myself. Like, is it Huntington's? Is it Tourette's? Is it all fake? What the hell does M have? But then, as if this couldn't get any weirder, People in that subreddit somehow find members of M's family and they start reaching out to them to ask, does M really have Tourette's? And eventually M's alleged sister releases an official statement to that subreddit, basically saying she can confirm that M does have Huntington's disease, but highly doubts M actually has Tourette's. Then M's mom jumps in and she releases an official statement to the subreddit. And she basically confirms that yes, M does in fact have Huntington's disease, but not Tourette's. So after all this heat, I guess it's too much for M to handle because M just completely deletes their TikTok and all their social media accounts. However, after a period of time, M reemerges with a new account and makes new content and focuses on not their Tourette's, but their paganism and witchcraft. Of course. Despite that, M is still keeping up the whole Tourette's act. I was literally bullied off the internet, so I do not do awareness for Tourette's anymore, regardless of the fact that I do have a clinical diagnosis. And of course, people go immediately to the comments and they just start destroying M all over again. And like influencers on YouTube start calling her out. Tourette's syndrome is not a joke. It is not something funny. So finally, after all that, M just deletes their TikTok again and all their other social media, and they haven't really been heard from since. Shout out to Pagan yarn. <laughs>